I think we're just in a slightly different place today because things are slightly ridiculous. <laughs> this is gonna be a short one. So I'm gonna tell you quick our plans for this weekend. So our plans were to celebrate our six month anniversary. This wasn't really intentional, but the place where we got married, they gave us free tickets to see a showing at their dinner theater because we got married at a dinner theater. And so I kind of not really realizing it, I booked it for six months from our wedding date. And so our plan was to go there, watch a cute musical, and then hang out that night. And then the next day, this was kind of a spur of the moment, someone I was in a musical with like a dozen years ago, like in high school, I found out via Facebook that they were the lead in a musical around like in the area. So I was like, I should get tickets for that. So Jake and I and a friend of ours, we were going to go see this musical. And that was going to be our very busy six month anniversary weekend. And life did not go that way. <laughs> so what ended up happening is this was like very belated. One of my employers was sick on Monday. Then my other employer, employer was sick on Tuesday. Wednesday, everything was fine. Thursday, I get to work. I was fine when I got there. And then I just slowly tanked. And I got there at like 9 and by 10.30, I was just like, I need to go home. I cannot, I cannot chase after twin toddlers the way that I'm feeling. This is impossible. So I went home, took a day off, you know, kind of like in and out of the bathroom all day, you know, TMI. And next day, I was miraculously fine. So Friday, I go into work. I'm good. I had like a great day at work. Work was amazing. Kids were great. Amazing listeners. Everything went super well. And I was like, heck yeah, we're on the road to a really good weekend. Because, you know, when I, when I was sick on Thursday, I was worried that it would trail into the weekend and I'd feel like crap. Well, I get home on Friday and immediately start feeling worse. Like, it's like I had, I was good all day at work, and then I get home, and I'm like, blah. And I start feeling really bad again. And then Saturday, not only was I still not feeling well, there was a blizzard overnight. So the roads were awful, and our show was a matinee performance. So we ended up having to call in, cancel those tickets, and we had, like, rescheduled to go. We had to pay an extra fee to reschedule. But like the tickets were free, so who cares? And it's still like a lot less than if we'd bought the tickets ourselves. So we rescheduled to go like, I don't know, like a month, month and a half later than we were originally planning. And I was sick like the whole day. It was not fun. And then Sunday comes around, I'm like, okay, we're gonna turn this around. I was feeling really terrible in the morning, but I was like, I'll get over this. The show is at two, I think it can manage. And um, Jake could tell I was feeling terrible, but Sunday is also my, like, get stuff done around the house day, so I was trying to get stuff done even though I felt bad. And Jake's like, stop, what can I do? And he was helping out. He made, he started a loaf of bread in our bread maker because I knew I wouldn't be able to eat much besides bland food because that's how I was feeling. And so he did that, and then maybe, like, an hour or two after he did that, then Jake is throwing up. And he's having the worst time. He could not concentrate, everything had to be quiet. He just like laid in bed for a long time because like not even watching YouTube videos was something like he could do. Everything was just too much for him. And he was back and forth in the bathroom, he was miserable. So that canceled Sunday. And then I feel terrible because I'm finally getting over it. And then like Jake's feeling awful. And so today is Monday. We didn't do anything fun all weekend, but I'm finally feeling better. Jake's feeling slightly better. He's at least able to like walk around and talk. He still took the day off because he needed time to like take a nap and chill out. Cause he said basically what happened to him um, to, to like yesterday was essentially what it was like on our wedding night he got very sick. He said it was basically that. That's what it was like. And I was like, oh God, cause I was asleep. I slept through that. But this time I was awake the whole time and I felt terrible cause I couldn't help besides like bringing him water and offering food that he did not want. <laughs> so yeah, that's, you know, didn't go the way we planned, but you know, happy six month anniversary to us. I <laughs> hope, our, hope our one year anniversary is uh, way better. <laughs> Bye.